The preparation of alkene is from from alkyl halide. See here. This example is simple one. CH three CH Cl CH three. This is under those elimination reaction in presence of thermal condition by applying of thermal. So this is you can write it like this. This sigma bond is shifted to here. This is completely eliminated. Here H plus here Cl minus elimination of HCl. It finally gives CH three CH double bond CH two. This is called as propene. This which propene one propene. And similarly, we consider another example. That is CH two. So CH three CH two Cl. So this example before this one we can write like the simple one. So in presence of heat, so through elimination reaction it gives CH two double bond CH two. We can simply written like this R CH two H CH two here Cl. This sigma bond is shifted to here. This is Cl is eliminated. So in presence of heat at thermal condition gives CH two double bond CH two. This is ethene. This is also same ethene, but this is which reaction? Elimination reaction. This is your elimination reaction. Through elimination reaction gives this one. Means alkyl halides are especially the removing of eliminating groups are always trans to each other. It always the eliminating group is position is at beta position at alpha and beta position. So that is the important one. And next one is so these are the preparation methods of alkenes, especially for ethylene. Next one is properties. Properties. Generally, the alkenes. Generally, the alkenes are based on isomers. These are two types of. Okay, in that one we discuss first um, conformations. Are not conformation. First we discuss only isomers. Isomerism. Isomerism of alkene. Isomerism of alkene. So generally the alkenes are exhibit structural isomerism, but Whereas alkenes are exhibit structural isomerism and stereo isomerism. Okay, the alkenes are exhibit structural isomerism and stereo isomerism. We already we know that structural isomerisms are different types like chain isomerism, positional isomerism, metamerism, tautomerism, but Stereo isomerisms are two types. One is optical isomerism and geometrical isomerism. Optical isomerism and next one is geometrical isomerism. Okay, these are the two types for isomerism of alkene. So now, example. So structural isomerism. For example. If you consider, so if it is five carbons are present, if it is whenever the five carbons are present, what is the name of that one? C five two into five two into five. That is our ten. C five H ten. So C five H ten. This is our pentene. So if it is pentene, what is the name? What is the formula? C five H twelve. This is our ten. Means pentene. So pentene is our alkene. The C five H ten is exhibit different. Chain uh, structural isomerism in that particularly chain isomerism or positional isomerism is possible. For example, if you if you represent like this, C H three, C H two, C H two, C H double bond C H two. Here one two three four five. 
so one two three four five so so number of hydrogens are ten see here three plus two five here two plus two four four plus five nine nine plus one ten so its formula is same so it's uh, what is the name of this one one pentene because root word is five carbons your unsaturated compound is in the double bond is present at first position now this is now represented in similar different way for example see here ch3 ch2 ch1 2 double bond ch ch3 now see here so total five carbons are present 1 2 3 4 5 five carbons are satisfied now hydrogens 3 plus 1 4 4 plus 2 6 6 plus 3 9 9 plus 1 10 so hydrogens are same see here 3 plus 2 5 6 7 7 plus 3 10 so what is the name of this one 1 2 3 4 5 so what is the name of this one 2 pentene this is our 2 pentene if we changing the changing of positions now another one another example see here this same example by changing of double bond on now this position again getting same one but you are changing like this so 2 pentene if you write 3 pentene is possible so 3 pentene so for example now i am seeing like that ch3 ch okay ch2 ch double bond ch ch3 so this is our same example for this one if you changing of these positions also same so means c5 h10 pentene is exhibit the positional isomerism this is our positional isomer this is also chain isomerism one is one pentene and two pentene means at first position one double bond second position either double bond this is our structural isomerism if you applicable for another one so if you consider c7 h14 the c7 h14 is exhibit different 